So the CFO agenda has been very helpful to us as we go into our practice because it's a great way when we're asked to go in and evaluate the accounting and financial structure of companies to go in and get some idea of where their strengths and weaknesses are. It is a tremendous tool to give us a guiding point for that process in particular because you're clearly not going to have to remember everything. You're certainly going to get an opportunity to go, okay, have I considered this as well? What should I be considering in my capital structure? What are my controllership functions? My internal controls that I should be concerned about? Uh, very much orientated towards all the elements that are important to you and your role as a CFO and the types of people and resources that are going to serve you in that CFO role. So it's detailed in its manner. It's very much laying out the types of concepts you should have around a treasury function, around a controllership function, around a capital transaction function, and that's what makes it a valuable tool for the people that use it. It's designed for us, it's a specific methodology, it's about the types of practice that we live in as CFOs, that's what we're known for in the market. So when you take this tool up, it isn't just a matter of going along and checking the boxes. You're asking yourself questions. Does this apply to where I am? Is this important at this client? Uh, if it is, drill down farther into it. Explore it with a client and use that judgment and experience to go along with it. It's meant to be combined with that judgment and that experience that our people have. And that's a core part of what Tatum is about.